Richard, what would you think of the whole Floyd Mayweather-McGregor event, how it turned out, how it built up? And oh, I'm so happy for, for Floyd and for McGregor and uh, for that it became such a huge commercial success. But I'm happy for the sport of boxing as well, uh, that uh, you know the way it turned out. Uh, I'm happy for the fight fans and all the people which purchased the event because uh, I have not seen one negative comment where people who purchased the event or watched it live uh, in Las Vegas complained uh, it was an entertainment uh, and everybody felt they got their money's worth and you know when you have to pay a hundred bucks for a pay-per-view or upwards to ten of ten thousand dollars for a ticket that you might end up after the fact some people complaining you know you could almost expect it but the fact that that didn't happen just shows you that uh, this was a success all around do we see more UFC boxing you know combos or is that pretty much it where we stop it i don't As know, a promoter, you know I, I i don't know i mean it was entertaining it was a financial success and uh, you know it was uh, it was closer than what people thought it would be um was it because you know floyd maybe carried him a bit or was it because uh, uh floyd maybe got a bit older or i i don't know but in the fact the fact that it was entertainment was entertainment at its best and so could I see potential other fights? Maybe. I'm sure some of the UFC athletes are going to be very encouraged by, by the pay-per-view results and by the, by the huge purse McGregor is going to walk away from. And they might say, hey, I want to go into boxing as well. Yeah. Richard, you've been a part of those kind of pay-per-views. You've done it for Mayweather many times. You've broke records with them. Is there an MMA fighter that you eye that you say, you know what, it would be a great matchup in boxing, crossover type fight? You know, uh, truth be told, I'm a big, uh, I'm a big boxing fan, and I don't really follow UFC as closely, so I can't, I couldn't really tell you. I mean, I saw no, some of the main names, but I haven't really thought about any, any matchmaking to match a UFC guy with another boxer. So I haven't really thought about it. But I'm sure there, you know, there would be some intriguing, intriguing matchups and. Uh, I think that uh, the UFC people, the, the MMA people, can hold their head high as well because their guy did well, did much better than most anticipated, and uh, and so you know, could I see other fights? Yes.